tutaambia nini watu wakikuuliza ah kilioko ni hiki nitawaambia hata kama ni conference huko naye usijaribu kwenda kwa ba sababu itakupa kama tope sababu hii matope yote nimepata wakati nilienda huko kukutana na watu kwa ba kama singeenda huko hii matope yote singepata kwa hivyo mtu akienda mbaya naye anaenda matope sasa ama mimi ni matope sasa ama we had an agreement we are two adults we agree to get a baby na wewe nilimaliza na wewe sijui una maswali ingine gani i'm the mother of your child you should respect me equally uje sunday afternoon kama hukuji that's the end of the story Hello Angel, I'm Angel Wanjiku and I'm here with my producer Collins Angel we are on road to 100,000 subscribers. I'm so excited. Let's continue subscribing so that we can get there. Now of course welcome back to the reunion show. As you can see hapa niko na Mr and Mrs Chege ambao ni mama na baba Kamau. Baba ka, baba baba Wawero, baba Wawero ako 70 years old, mama Wawero ako 58 years old and then we have another girl here ambaye anaitwa Naomi. Naomi is 24 years old. She has a 1 year old child ambaye wamepata na Mr Chege and that's why she is here today because he has been ghosting her hajakuwa akimprovidea hajakuwa akimtumia pesa ya upkeep ya mtoto na rent and everything and of course the wife didn't know about all this that's why tuko hapa leo tuone how we are going to help solve the situation so amekuja hapa ndio hawa tumewapata na umesema you knew this man had a wife yes I knew he had a wife lakini sasa when we met I actually found him with another lady who was a, a former colleague of mine he was dating uh, him aha rather sasa aka aka huyo best yangu akaniambia this guy provides ni nini you know lazima and after a living so that's when we met in Kamaki's it was not a coincidence per se because mm -hmm. I was planning to meet him and then he said he was going to provide and he was going to treat me and that's so, exactly what he did so you 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 had someone else apart from her ndo akakunyang'anya kutoka kwa beshte yake ah wakati yeye anasema mimi nilikuwa na mkutano ya kanisa nilikuwa na wana yu nilikuwa nakutana huko mkutano wa kanisa wapi kama kis naye huyu akaanza akakutana na kanisa kama kis sema oh hata yeye ni mwana youth sasa nikamuliza wewe ni mwana yuthi wa kanisa gani akaniese kani, naye akaanza kusema oh wana yuthi ni waina mingi sasa hmm. nikamwambia wana yuthi wangu wewe mimi napenda napenda ni wana yuthi no 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 vile ulikuja ukaniuliza uh, nikushikie drinks ngapi nikakwambia ngapi ukanishikia hapo haraka haraka and then you sat down and we started having a conversation and tuka hata hatukuka tukaanza kupanga vile we are going to be in a relationship so, hold, on, hold on hold on Uh, na naona ni kama sikusikia vizuri. Kwa hivyo mbele ya huyu malaya ulikuwa na malaya. You have the audacity ya kuniita malaya. Mwingine rafiki yake malaya mwingine kwako? Eh? Wale tulikuwa na kutana. Mtoto wa youth nimekuliza before huyu malaya ulikuwa na malaya mwingine. Malaya mgani? Mimi si malaya. Wewe wewe kwenda kutafuta tafuta wazee watu kwa sababu umesikia uko na pesa. That is You're not any better than the koinange wana ebu endelea wewe na wewe. I'm not a prostitute yake mbele yake. Fine to make a living. Life is hard. Nini? Analo like una anasema iko na mtoto wako. for the law so I take a loan for that because oh, i know my i'm goodness yes. me i don't need a loan to hire lawyers my goodness me yolo neko itaisha uchukue ingine hivyo hivyo yeah because i know at the end of the day napata kenya nataka hii ndio ile ujingo umeletea kwa boma sasa hii hii ndio ile upuzi umeletea kwa boma in the name of being of being a church elder hii ndio ile unadanganywa mtoto ni carbon copy hizo mpesa zilikuwa zako you know 
wani ulikuwa si wako na nini kuwa okay okay fine si kuwa that one i agree so let me ask Go, hang on hang on uh-huh. si kuwa hizo mpesa ulikuwa unamtumia nchi ya magadi alikuwa amekulimia exactly hizo <laughs> mpesa si nilikuwa i'm getting old shaggy yeah, it's getting old it's just like that this is your child fanya hivi fanya hivi no 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 fanya hivi to make it better to make it better kubali Exactly. To make it better kubali it's getting tu. Getting exhausting by the way. <laughs> kubali mtoto ni wako and you take responsibility. Yeah. Yeah. Kubali tu. We are arguing and it's we are not pesa ni zako. Uwe mtoto anafanana na Kinodia? Sawa. So just kubali tu ni wako. It could be maybe a bit better. And kubali u take responsibility yako. And this time I don't take, I don't want 20,000. I'm moving to a bigger house. So nataka 50,000 per month. Ukakunya pombe yangu nikakunya soda yangu mambo iliisha hapo. Iliishia hapo. Ilishia hapo nini? Wao ulikuwa unafanya kazi gani? Mimi uh, kitambo nilikuwa na wake sales mm-hmm. kwa duka fulani tao mm-hmm. and that's when nilienda nikapata mbeshi yangu. Nasikia mm-hmm. she's a sales girl. Ndio wanaenda kutafuta tafuta wanaume wa watu na fanyanga sales. Yako ni nini? Wewe kwa na job. Kwa kuwa wife, you know, go to wife. You know, concentrate you know, kwa go to wife. You know, go to nyumbani you know, looking all you know, ragged. Oliver is one who looks who does sales. Yeah. Me I have my own business my dear. Ebu aendelea na hiyo competition mama you you should be having your own business mimi sai i don't have a job and i want to be treated and to stay at home yes yes si lazima niende kazi kila wakati ati kutafuta that's why you should take your responsibility na shida haya when i what do you have to say about this prostitute of yours excuse me i am not a prostitute i was just having a relationship just like you are Me I'm married. Me I was not having a relationship. Me I'm not. Did you have a relationship before you got married? So, so you are waiting for him to marry you. A 70 year old. Wena we. A 70 year old marriage responsibility. As a matter of fact, mtoto wangu anataka father figure. Ni kukwambia atakuwa. Of course I was not looking forward to get married to him. It was all about nipate mtoto, tulee mtoto maisha ikuwe soft. I can get another man in the future, but for now take your responsibility. Ulipe nyumba, ulipe bills and life moves on. Kama hivi, unataka mahali ya kujishikiria. Sema unataka mahali ya kujishikilia. Kujishikilia nini? Kujishikilia nini? Wewe take responsibility yako. Ulipe yeah. nyumba, ulipe house girl yeah. jusai I have to put up a business. Yeah. Uh, ulipe house girl, ulipe bills, pampas na tumianga pampas. Uh, mtoto na tumianga pampas. Yeah. Yote, yeah. yote yeah. mimi niweze. Exactly. That is your responsibility. Yeah. Kwa nini na wewe utaweza? Hebu ngoja kidogo ni girl. Kwa nini wewe utaweza? Si ulienda na mkala na na mkapata mtoto. Wewe nimekuweza? Ati umeniweza mimi nimejiweza mimi siku ni niweze mpaka unaenda kutangataka huko ukienda kufuata wengine sasa what is go- no what is going to happen now mm-hmm. and you be polite because i'm the, i'm the, mimi sasa ndio nini ndio nimeshikilia hiyo nini i can say usaidiwa msaidiwe i can make him help you or make him not help you so so we, so we need respect here we accept respond huyo ni msichana mwenye umekuwa na yeye na mko na mtoto nani huyo this lady here Naomi mtoto wa nani it's getting old go, 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 it's getting old. so mr chege yeah. because there's a lot of evidence yenye kwa against you yenye wamesema amesema mtoto ametuonyesha picha your wife amesema mtoto anakufanana mm-hmm. tumeona mpesa statements mm-hmm. you are saying your name is not chege ben there's no chege ben in your family mm-hmm. but she's saying it's your number mm-hmm. what do you have to say about hizo vitu zote ah kufupisha hii tuseme hii nimekubali na tumaliza hiyo maneno hivyo kitambo atungekuwa hapa mshindo umesema who is this who is this haja ya huyu aisa kusema chochote sababu anataka pesa of course take your responsibility mimi silelei mtu mtoto you should know your responsibility kwa hapa haja yake kubwa ni pesa kipa pesa acha maneno ungechukua responsibility hata yako i wouldn't be here actually i wouldn't confront your wife but right now we are getting here because ulikataa responsibility yako kusa nataka pesa she can say anything sasa yule kuna nakataa mtoini wako and i can say anything eh hata sai sasa umekubali mtoto ni wako si ndio mtoto anakufanana kabisa sasa she can say anything aje sisi hata siku zile tulikuwa na sugar daddies they used to take responsibility oh hata ulikuwa na sugar daddy yes, and you are judging me calling me a prostitute yes, because you're picking my you're checking my husband coming again ya yeah? anyway so unasikia so you you also had a sugar daddy yes when i was young i mean that was the in thing then So you but, understand but what she's going to do understanding yeah alichukua grandfather wake me was not taking my grandfather ndiko anachukua mtu you know almost grandfather you gonna pesa sawa grandfather this is your granddad muulize muulize akinikatia alikuwa na kujua ni grandfather that's all i can say 
It's karma happening to you. It doesn't matter. Kama ni bibi mzee ama bwana mzee ama whoever. You also did this and stop judging me. And I'm not a prostitute for your information. Because this is your grandfather. Mi wangu alikuwa 40s. Nikiwa 20 sawa. Wewe uko alikuwa na bibi. No 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 no. Alikuwa na bibi bado. I don't care whether alikuwa na bibi. Na shit you are judging me just because I have an older guy. Wewe na wenye mazi you're the one who got us into this place in the first place. Kile ni ya nini? Kama imesemekana hivyo imesemekana. But the end of the day I will judge. Sio mimi mnasema hapana nimekataa. Kita umekataa na umekubali which is which umekubali wewe waisa i know you can say anything because you want money but ujue mimi ndio mzee mwenye mboma kwa hivyo ungechukua responsibility sijui what you uje unirukie hapa ni ukuje pole pole ni ukuje pole pole hiyo time yote nimekuwa nikupigia for the last six months na kupigia na kupigia wani na kupigia bado you are ghosting me and right now unasema ningekuja pole pole hiyo time ukitaka nini i was respecting your marriage but wewe ndo umeanza hizi drama kushinda mwingine naye umdaganya daganye ni mdaganya na mtoto ni wako mtoto ni wako ukitaka lakini i don't even want a relationship with you cuz i can't handle this It's getting old in a chosha. Tumekubali tumekubaliana. Je, wewe umekubali huyo mtoto huyu msichana ni wako? Na umekubali ulikuwa umalaya kwa nini moja na yeye? Nimekubali. Kama ni kama nimekubali lakini so so what? Ulipe bills, ulipe nyumba, ubai pampa. That's exactly what a father should do. Na kuje uone mtoto hii. Nimfanye nini na yeye? Hata kama ni wangu ninakuja kufanya nini na yeye? Mtoto wako si amesema anataka baba mtoto akue na father figure. Mtoto hataki father figure. Kwanza hata wewe si figure you are actually the father of that child. Exactly. So what? So you take responsibility. Nikikataa. Niseme sifanyi hivyo. Don't worry about it. Wewe ndio nanyonya na ninyonyi mimi. Let me let me I think we need to settle this. First and for first and foremost involving law will cost you because we have money and for that reason nataka sasa already wewe unataka pesa za ku za ku bring up mtoto wako sasa involving law it shows kabisa you know hata ku drag huyu mzee into it as much as he's the biological father clearly ni pesa unataka za kulea mtoto si ndio involving law means you how ability yake usiende kwa kwa leni wezani nayo basi achukue responsibility is what i'm trying to settle to go back and forth back and forth i take responsibility yake alipe bills alipe nyumba Alinilipia kila kitu. Sikiliza, sikiliza. Uh, I want you to come to my I don't know what you're doing on Sunday afternoon after church. I want you to come to my house with that child. We sit tuache kupeleka vitu publicly. Okay? We sit and discuss this and I will make sure he takes care of that child. Look at me girl. Nilikwambia respect hapo una. Hapa mimi mimi una nini kuliko huyu mzee? Sana. Just as much as he's the head of the house, I also have my own uh, my own needs or uh, in that It's not been easy. So, It's not I been easy. That. Just, but you see, don't get angry at me. I didn't get you pregnant. He's the one who got you pregnant. Unaona? And me I, I didn't ask him to get you pregnant. Mulitafutana, mukapendana, mukafanya vile mlifanya. Amekuwa akili ghost for the last one year. Of all these nonsense of yours, the two of you. Unaona? Wewe na wewe ghost for one year. Baba wewe responsibility hata hatungefika hapa. Ilikuwa done deal. Baba wewe hiyo yetu ya, ya kufanya tuletwe kwa, kwa, kwa national ninio we'll deal with it ukifika kwa nyumba because i am not happy about this you don't know how many people are watching or listening to this thing hata abroad eh kijana wetu ngambo labda atakuwa at, anaambia na watu eh busi kiliza i don't know what you know that is so wrong number two, huyu msichana you are you available on sunday afternoon i'll see what i can do you'll see what you can do, you can do and it's about your child You need to be there. What I can do. If you don't have time that Sunday, never come. Watch it shaivo. Yes. Because I'm giving her the opportunity. I'm also busy. And I and I don't need to jipange. Sasa unajipanga nini? Leo ni lini? Leo ni Friday. I have to panga myself between today tomorrow is at home. Watch you panga this. Umetuambia ufanye kazi, unajipanga kufanya. Mimi mwenyewe na mimi mwenyewe mimi mwenyewe nafanya kazi. Mimi mwenyewe ama church ama church leader and I'm availing myself then. Wewe you don't go to church clearly kama kizi your church okay. number two, <coughs> eh you don't have a job you, you don't go to church I don't have time right now I don't even have a nanny mm. ni kushinda mtu huyu amelia church what's the need say sit in the house mm. and then to nilem to pole pole junikienda church kila wakati mtu huyu analia ako one year 
Unaona vile mtu yeye anakuanga stable na sina nani mtu wa kunisaidia. Nishinde hapo nimebe I me I don't have time for that. So let me ask so, you no, in conclusion before you ask me are you coming on Sunday or you're not afternoon? Amesema atafikiria so me I had a so, question. Mimi nataka ajue ndivyo na mimi nijipange na vitu zingine that Sunday because okay. I don't need to be in the house. Okay. Unanielewa? Because I wanted to ask you yes. I know you are hurt right now. Yes. Did you ever know your husband was ever going to cheat on you? No. That one I never because even me mm. as far as I've been in that marriage I've never cheated on him. Never ever. Mm. Even thinking mm. I'm too busy nikitafuta pesa. Mimi si ndio time ya cheat. Ye naona ashatafuta asha retire asha decide kwenda Kamakis ati kwa group ya youth. Si eti ameanza leo ni vile imekama out leo. Umtu amekuwa akikuchitia. Unamsifu unamsifu unamsifu. Huu mzee amekuwa na uh, another friend of mine. Ndio tu, waliachana tukachukuana. Yeah, I heard about that. Wewe sasa friend na ni mlao ulitoa wapi na yeye mwingine? Wewe naye yote na unaabiga unasema eh eh eh. Sasa kwa nini sema kuna mtoto? Huyu huyu unataki hata simpisa ile nini nakwambia sio mwingine. Ndio na yo. No, listen to anybody else. No, I will, It's me. I will listen to her. Ndio unasema. Sikatai wewe ndio unasema you're the head of the house. That one I agree. I have no dispute about that. I'm listening to her because she's even come up with an evidence. Exactly. Kama kama nani unamsikiza kama nani? Kama kama mimi kama second wife wako. Kama second wife wako. Yes. Unamsikiza puta it was me si second wife. Kama nani? Umezaa na yeye kama sikunisikiza mimi mimi ndio bwana yako. Yeye amezaa mtoto wako. Let's talk about your marriage kidogo now that this one is coming up and you're arguing. Did you ever have issues that nyazili lead to wewe kuenda out of your marriage? Kanio. Mulikuwa na ma Mulikuwa na mambo yenye ilikuwa inaendelea hapa ndio ukatoka nje ukatafuta mtu. Hiyo hiyo ni kiutu ni usemekana saa nyingine mna hapa down here unaenda ku refresh kidogo hapo nje. Okay. That can happen. So Sasa sijui tuna asida hapa tukifanya nini. Hiyo ni kitu tulisolve na tukamaliza. Resolve na nani? Na tuna nani? Ujue si agree hivyo. Pole pole. Pole pole nimejaribu for the last one year. Hata ungekuwa tumefika hapa. I'm getting exhausted. Kushinda hapa nikikwambia what you should do. Tumekuja hapa tumiongea for the last hour an hour. Ukisema mtoto si wako sasa umekubali. Kubali chukua responsibility. Let's go to on with life. So, Mimi sarudi soko. I'm still very young. Let me ask you Naomi. Mm -hmm. Did you ever want to have like a full blown relationship na yeye penye ana step in as your husband? Oh god no. No. <laughs> no. no. Nilikuwa nataka achukue responsibility yake and to let him to let that's that was the only reason that I was with so him. So how are you feeling because you're breaking someone's marriage here right now? I'm breaking their marriage as I have said. I don't want to be his wife. I am just he, his baby mother. Kuja uka ukawaelezea ukaelezea bibi yake umekuwa na yeye for that two years. Yes. For him to take responsibility for him to give me a don't soft life. Don't you feel like sponsor in short? And his sponsor and he lipi a bill and ibe hiyo shamba liko amesema I live a soft life as I wait for my future husband. So how are you feeling a kiongela leven ya she's going to siphon money from your family? One that is out she won't shamba shamba ende kwa family yao that one she won't get but as for bringing up the child that one we can work on it. Mm -hmm. Yes. The rest you need dream. Mm. Yeah ita come true pande we labda tafute mali pengine. Mzee unacheka. Mimi nacheka ni sababu Nasikia mambo ambaye haiwezekani. Hai mm -hmm. Eh. Mambo ya kuingilia mambo ya shamba nini itoke wapi? Mm -hmm. Eh. So hakuna shamba unampatia? I, itoke wapi? Hakuna. Shamba ni naye ni ya bibi yangu na watoto wangu. Mm -hmm. Eh. So wewe una feel vibaya bibi yako amepata amekupata umekuwa ukikuwa na mtu mwingine? Ah, uh, kwanza mimi nasikia vibaya bibi yangu akiletewa mambo ya huko nje ambaye haifai. Mm -hmm. Eh. Hapa. Shaka, we wouldn't be here if you had taken your responsibility. I didn't want drama. Hata mimi unajua spend drama. Nimekuwa mkul for one year, but now I am exhausted. Unajua bills vile zinakuanga expensive and in this economy. Kwa nini wewe hauna kazi? Nili lose job yangu after nimeenda kupata mtu hii. Because when you go to when you when you are in sales mm -hmm. uh, when you go to get pregnancy uh, I took a uh, six months and then that's when I was laid off because i needed to bring up my child i was not even able to uh, to ku andika nani so i had to take care of my child was this pregnancy planned of course Where? it was planned pregnancy no no she said, Why were you she said nipatie mtoi nipatie mtoi 
Ukasema unataka mtoto wa msichana. Of course I want a msichana. Because you only have boys so ukasema you want a baby girl. Yeah. So you planned for this pregnancy. He insisted every time. She, told, she told us that uh, yeye yeah, alimwambia ukipata mtoto, ukinipatia mtoto wangu nitakununulia sijui nitakununulia shamba or something. How are you feeling right now because I, I I can't I can't explain how I feel right now. Mm-hmm. Mm, I just can't explain how I feel right now. Because clearly alikuwa ame plan yes, kupata so mtoto. Huyu msichana alikuja akasema alimwambia pata mtoto wa kike nikununulia a piece of land. Yes. And I make you comfortable. That's what she told us exactly. in the beginning of this. Mm-hmm. Uh, see, at see forty. I'm angry, but but don't nashi kama neno. Right now, I don't know how I feel. For a baby girl, what and I was willing to give him a baby girl, but unfortunately, look about a kato boy. So either way, mtoto ni wake. Si lazima ati juni boy ya asema sasa ata take responsibility. It's wrong. So it was a plan. I didn't choose ati kupata kijana. Eh, ama that's the reason why you stopped you supporting you to have a kid with someone mwenye ako na familia na hadi ako na watoto wakubwa a baby girl i also was looking for a soft life why not so why we many promise a good life let me ask jerry here jerry in your marriage mko na msichana hapana we only have boys we only have boys did it ever come up as an issue that you guys don't have a girl no it never came up as an issue but ana ye ni mommy's boy Mama yake alikuwa anampenda sana me her soul rest in peace. Alikuwa anampenda sana. So I I can understand I can I can try to understand what she's saying. There's there's some truth. Kwa hii story tu yao yote akakafi akao kwa upuzi. There's some truth in it. Mm-hmm. Yes. So you wanted a baby girl because ulikuwa unataka ku feel alikuwa ulikuwa unataka itwe jina ya mama yako ama Ah uh, well ni sema nini? Sawa akiitwa wote. Mm. mm. So right now because the wife is saying kama utaenda Sunday mu discuss ndo akusaidie venye utapata finances from their family. Yeah, that's what I want. Mm-hmm. Alipe bills zake, alipe nyumba, I want to get a nanny because I want to go back to work. Aniyekea biashara. Actually that would be the best thing. Aniyekea biashara. Unaongezea tu biashara tena si shamba, tena ni biashara. Mtamwekea biashara. Akikuja Sunday if she comes on Sunday afternoon we'll talk. If she doesn't come on that Sunday me me I'm not part of this. Yeah. You don't feel like she's there for your money? No. You know what she, what she's asking for she won't necessarily get. But we will see what we can do for that child. Yes. A business would work because I will also have security. That's what I was looking for. At least a business na at least akuwa natuma hiyo 20000 per month. Hiyo hata tuma na business utapata. Mtoto hapa t- we are here because of the child. We are here because of the child. Do, what about the child's mom? The child the child's mom is so not I'll be living outside as he live in the house he's paying. Ama let me get this straight. Now we are not going to discuss this here. That's why I said you come on Sunday afternoon. Forever. So I like our relationship. Yako do you feel like we are going to solve issues between you two? We'll see, we'll see. Let that Sunday come, we'll see. So right now you don't feel like you want I to talk anymore. Like talking, I don't I don't even know how I feel. I'm just there. Mm. Yeah. So you you don't you you want the show to end at this point. It can end at any point. Wamemaliza drama zao hawa. Tutachukua responsibility yake, tutoke hapa it's all. Na simwaambiwa huyo ata utasaidiwa na familia yake. Wafanye hivyo si waseme hapa venye tuko show after tumeenda we start arguing because even though probably kutaenda i start yeah, calling the thing you come on sunday me i'm not the one who gave us at i'll ghost you yeah. sawa me i just said if you come, you come, you come on sunday afternoon we will discuss this and look for a solution if you don't come on sunday afternoon just never come yeah. it's as simple as that the story hmm. yeah So right now ni kama are you taking your husband's side ama umemkasirikia pia yeye Of course nimemkasirikia how can I be happy mm-hmm. Anaenda kutafuta mjukuu wa kaza na yeye How can I be happy No I'm not happy This one will go and solve it in the house I am not ready to wash my dirty linen here mm-hmm. Yeah we'll What do you it. think the church will say when they wakisikia vitu kama hizi ama wakiona Sasa hiyo ni itakuwa ni hiyo ni itakuwa ni shida yake mm-hmm. That one I cannot cover him I cannot say no it didn't happen no the child is not his no No that one he will know how to deal with it. The church will be very very cross with him. Mm. Yeah. Mr. Mr. Chege, yeah. unataka kuambia bibi yako uko sorry for what you have done, oh, what well, you have put well, her through. I can say I can say sorry to her. Mm. But akawe akijua 
kwangu ni kwangu sio kwetu mnakuja pole pole siku nirukia yeah hakuna mtu amekurukia baba weru wewe ndio umefanya tukue hapa in the first place tulianza hiki tu vizuri kama councilors wa church it ended up being umein pregnant mtoto anatushana kama granddaughter wako so you got us into this mess hakuna kuja pole pole mimi sija ku disrespect nimeku respect is there anything wrong i, I said no you are the one who got us into this so you can't always ex expect mimi niwe na clap nimefurahi kwa sababu wewe ndio usema na wewe head of the house no even the head of the house can be wrong of which you are now today and this is a very tutashinda hapa tu tutashindi hapa but hapa tu kwa hii maneno kidogo kidogo hii sasa nisi maneno kidogo hapa kuna mtoto ujalea hii kama inaisha iishe mimi nacherewa kwenda mahali i'm expecting someone in the office yeah so you are expected somewhere yeah So Masama will retire right now you are just staying home. Mama you are going to meet ah. some other girl somewhere. I'm going to meet you some other better. elders like me. Uh -huh. We plan for we plan for for better tomorrow. Uh -huh. Not not to to mama to dogo to dogo hapa saa yote. Uh -huh. For what? So uh, your child ni mambo madogo madogo. Hiyo ameambiwa tayari na bibi yangu aje sandi kama hakuji that's the end of the story. Uh -huh. yeah, and that's all. Where? Well. That's all from you. Yeah, me yeah, have nothing to say. Mm. Your marriage is still going to be okay. Like I said I don't wash my dirty linen. I will deal with it when we get to the house. Do you think you're going to tell your kids what has happened? Oh yes. Oh yes, as we are open. Our family is an open book. Mm -hmm. Yes, they'll have to know. In fact after this is when I'll tell them. Mm -hmm. Yes. Because we have thousands of people who are going to watch this video and maybe wengine watakuwa neighbors, wengine watakuwa familia, wengine watakuwa nini. How are you guys going to approach it when they ask? Personally I won't approach it. I'll send them to him. He's the one who got himself into this mess. Me I'm not part of this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what I'll do. So you should be asking him that question, not mm -hmm. me. Mr. Chege. Mm -hmm. Unasikia aibu ama unasikia kama utaambia nini watu wakikuuliza ah kilioko ni hiki nitawaambia hata kama ni conference huko naye usijaribu kwenda kwa ba sababu itakupaka matope sababu hii matope yote nimepata wakati nilienda huko kukutana na watu kwa ba kama singeenda huko hii matope yote singepata kwa hivyo mtu akienda mbaya naye anaenda matope sasa ama mimi ni matope sasa ama We had an agreement. We are two adults. We agree to get a baby. Nilimaliza na wewe. Nilimaliza na wewe. Sijui una maswali ngine gani. I'm the mother of your child. You should respect me equally. Uje Sunday afternoon. Kama hukuji, that's the end of the story. Na sisi tunaenda chini kama bibi na bwana tukae chini. We do the best we can. Kwa hivyo atatupata na, na results kama hakuji is up to yeah so nyenye of course it's good to see that you are solid saizi na joke una uko heart na bado tunaona mko hapa na mume stand as one person si ndio ndio mm. hata kama maybe ni aibu pia wewe juu haukuku unajua kwa nini unakuja hapa alafu unapata msichana mwingine and then being involved with the church mm -hmm. we cancel the youth this was the last thing i expected to happen to me mm in my family. Mm. Yes. Mr. Chege? Yeah. Now oh, wait, m Mrs. Chege, do you think he's remorseful? Do you think I'm going to apologize vizuri na do you think uta muta move past this? Ku apologize at apologize. Ku apologize. You know at apologize. Hapa kuna kitu amefanya. He he apologize. Yeah. I expect more. Mm. You're going to show her more. Hiyo ni yetu na kwetu nyumbani. Yeah. Tukisha tukisha ingia kwa nini kwa table room? tutakae chini tutasolve everything at the end of the day you come up with one resolution mm -hmm. yeah okay mm. so now we can clearly see what that five years of marriage in a, in a letter ni ni ku understandiana ndo maana you are so calm right now ama ni ni kujua partner wako ndo inakufanya ukuwe very respectful even in this kinds of situations ama kunaendaje do you know you look at where you've come from mm. these are 35 years uh, and what you're going to lose i'm not saying i'm happy i'm not encouraging i'm not expecting him to go and get another person again i wanaopanga line hivi wewe umepata msichana wewe kijana hivyo you know 
but uh, there are things you just uh, I'm not going to overlook it because this is a big discussion which I will involve my family my family being my children uh, but uh, you know you just can't walk out you know mm -hmm. you just can't pack your things work kwa kinini and you walk out no Mr. Chege, kama bibi yako hange jua leo, there's someone else in your life. Are you ever going to tell her? Hmm, hata hii ni maajabu. Sababu, siku expect vitu kama hizi. Iyo kai hapa. But, um, all in all, it happened. Na vile it happened, na tume, tumeongea, na tumeimalizia. Siyo ni vile ya turundie, turundie. Akuja sande, atukuja, akuja si tumekuwa na bibi, na kamukuji yetu, tumekapa, come up with one resolution. Okay. But kama hainge fika hapa, o oh, unge niambia? Ah, Ninga kuambia. Unge niambia lini na umekuu kiruka ruka uyu mtoto wako, uyu mtoto mbulizana. Babu, hiyo miaka yote, hiyo miaka yote tuko na wewe. Mm. Umewa yona ni, 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 ni kiwa ni kombo kombo mimi. Wesi kui wesi kuona ni ni bibona yako anapoka kwa matope. Siwezi ona ni bwana wangu anapoka kwa matope kwa sababu siwezi kufikiria ta siwezi ona because huyo mtoto hiyo picha tulionyeshwa mm. kwanza anafanana na Kinudia mm. our third born. Mm. Na Kinudia ni product yako. Mm. So anafanana na wewe. Mm. Number 2 hizo Mpesa messages hiyo mm. hiyo hiyo ni wewe. Mm. Sasa siwezi fikiria mimi ninaona. You know I'm being oh realistic. Uh -huh. yes. So uh, ungeniambia ever ati uko na mtoto nje ama tungengoja siku ya mazishi unajua sasa hiyo ndio tutoto tunatokaga eh na fulani unaona ule kwanza hao nje ni carbon copy yes. ya mwenye kuenda mm -hmm. ama tungengoja hiyo siku sorry nge, nge, i'm sorry to ask would you have told me you had an affair with someone ningekuwa surprise hunga hunga kubali oh sasa uliacha ni surprise na watu wengine tupike hapa ndio muambie yeah have nothing to so, say naona kama tumemalizia hivyo akuja sande Akuja tumeongea, tume, 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 tume tupatia anza. Mm -hmm. That's all. Okay. Yeah. So I think that's it, angels. Let's uh, meet in the next one. That's been it for me. And as always, giving up should never be an option. Bye.